Hey, what's going on, YouTube? We're here, Pure Cage and Outdoors. Uh, gonna be doing some fishing. We fishing yesterday, caught a couple of decent catfish. Catfish are running right now. Unfortunately, I lost another cast net snag on whatever. I have no idea. So, went run to the marine store, got another cast net. We're gonna go try to catch some, uh, some more fresh bait because that seems to be what they want right now fresh shad. And, uh, so we're gonna go catch some more of that, try to at least, and get back out on the water, and I'll come back at y'all again. What's going on, YouTube? Talk to y'all earlier we was on our way to get a cast net we got a cast net we're back at the little spot where we go to get bait we gonna give it a shot i don't know what we're gonna catch if anything but i want to show y'all the cast net that i use i picked up uh i'm not sponsored by none of these cast net come this is what i use it's at a local uh marine company that i go to and, and pick them up nothing special it's a five tech net so here we go super spreader cast net this is the seven foot radius, but the five eighths mesh, one pound per radius foot. I like this net because it sinks quick enough, being just a five eighth. Uh, it'll sink quick enough to still catch some of your mullets and still catch some smaller shad, depending on what type of fishing I like to do. Now they have the one inch for mullet nets and things like that, that sink quicker. You'll lose a lot of smaller baits and that's cool. But sometimes I fish jug lines, bush lines and smaller shad is what I need in smaller baits. So this net still gets it done, still sinks quick enough. We're gonna open this thing up brand new, throw it in the water and let's see if we can catch some bait. what we're gonna get on this first cast and that's still new so I'm not sure if it's gonna open up not open up here we go definitely still has that new net feel to it we got a couple small thread pin shad three of them that ain't too bad definitely smaller than what I want to use right now for bait but with them smaller ones I still take them in I'll put four or five of them on a hook and give a big bait presentation I still don't think I said it. Oh yeah, I said him. He's pulling pretty good, boy. Uh-uh, all I do is use a gaff. Let's tighten his drag up. <coughs> he got a little size to him. Oh, he got a nice size to him. Yeah, he, he That's what I've feeling. Oh yeah. Come on, boy, this fish got some. Come on, Nile, Leroy. Come on. Come on, Herbert Martin, get that fish up, boy. That fish feel kind of heavy, boy. Oh, he's pulling. Yeah, I'm about to go. Hey, Junior, take that pole out the holder and come behind me. Coming in low. Yeah, he did. He scared the hell out of me. Come on, Tommy. Boy, he's big. Might man. be 20 something. Pull up old dead, man. Ooh, look at. Ooh, 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 there he is. Ooh, ooh, look at. Ooh, ooh, look at. Ooh. About 15, 20. Oh, yeah. 
that's meat. Look at that meat right there. That's a big fish too. Oh, that's what I do with them big fillets. Fish on. Yeah, well, that's probably a 716. It's a little much. He ain't that big. Come on, don't let go. Don't let go. The port line. Uh, don't let go. Would be like a, a quarter of an inch if it's the four <clears throat> big line, or they got some little ones in there. Nice. Give me my gas. Something else done caught this boy, he got off. <laughs> Something else hooked him and he popped though. Look at that green cork on there with that leader. Yeah. The one that no, but that's something else. Somebody else missed him. Got another 20 pound blue. Feel them pulling set. Oh yeah, fish on. Fish on. Nice blue. I see the head shakes. Get them, son. What we got? What we got? <laughs> He's working them, y'all. Been trying to put them on a big fish now for almost a year. I see that line. See the head shakes. Come in here, coach. Uh, let's start walking your way behind me real quick. Let me get this pole up. Come up underneath me. Hold up, I got one more. Let me get it out your way. Nice blue, boy, nice blue. Hold on, part of something pounded right here, son. What you thought about that, dude? Hell yeah. <laughs> We've been trying to get him a nice big blue cat for a year now. Finally got him out here with some good bait. We got us a nice fish, people. We're gonna go get a scale, we'll see what he weighs, and we'll be back. All right, guys, here we go. Nick James with his personal best blue cat. How was it, man? Uh, amazing. Amazing. Is it everything you've been waiting for? Everything and more. <laughs> Beautiful fish, guys. Beautiful fish. I love them when they're pretty gray colored like this and white. You can tell they've been eating good for the winter time. Another beautiful cat. We're going to get away from this dock right here. It's a lot of mud. We can't release them right here. So we'll take care of that a little later. While he's still good, we got pictures. We got everything. So Fear Cage and Outdoors bringing y'all some more beautiful blue cats. <laughs> 